Assalamualaikum dan selamat malam to all our viewers out there tuning in live. This is a big moment for Toyota. Toyota's biggest launch of the year 2020. My name is Nazmi Rahman, your host for tonight. And with me, when we talk about Toyota, we talk about ambassadors. Here is the Yaris ambassador with me. Jana Nick is with us. Assalamualaikum Jana. Hi Abah. Ding, jini, sweet, macam tu. Rasa macam Sehat. Alhamdulillah, sehat kalau bersama dengan Jana Nick. Tu rasa macam kat Melody, gitu. Uh. Wah, wow, <laughs> tapi satu hari yang bersejarah buat Ambassador Yaris. Ya, yeah, betul. Hari ini sangatlah hari yang bermakna buat saya sebab uh, hari ini uh, buat kali kedua saya dilantik dan diberi kepercayaan oleh Toyota untuk menjadi Ambassador kepada Yaris. Ah. Dan hari ini kita nak kongsikan kepada anda yeah. Yaris yang baru. Yes, that's ah. right. Dan ada satu kejutan di akhir rancangan nanti. So, please tell everybody, stick with us. Jangan ke mana-mana. Jangan. Betul. Ke. Bila dia cakap jangan ke mana-mana, kita semua... Eh, cakap pasal jangan. Wow! Kalau kan, kalau ada ambassador Yaris, mesti ada ambassador Vios. Eh, lah, Pak Ujantan Tahu. Lah, lah, malu-malu. Encik Syukri, ya, ya kita. Selamat malam. Waalaikumsalam. Hai, Syukri. Encik, dia nampak sopan je. Tapi sebenarnya dia excited sebab hari yang besar buat Vios juga hari ni, kan? Yep. Ha, jadi, macam mana perasaan sebagai ambassador? Okey, sebagai ambassador, uh, saya sangat teruja untuk kali kedua. Hmm. Uh, saya menjadi ambassador. Terima kasih, Toyota. Dan, Bang, hmm. saya excited sangat. Oh, yes. Tunjukkan Abang Vios yang baru kali ni. Hmm. Eh, bukannya cantik lah, Bang. Tapi dia punya safety. Oh, apa tahu tak? Dia punya safety, ya? Eh, ha, ni jangan pecah terbelang. Ha. Everybody's waiting for the excitement of these two new vehicles. You want to pecah terbelang. Sabar, tunggu dulu semua. Okey, Abang. Saya yeah. dari sini, saya dah nampak satu. Itu benda yang besar yang dilitupi yeah. oleh kain hitam. Jadi saya tak sabar nak ke sana. Tajam mata-mata mereka. Jom, jom, jom yeah. ikut saya. For our viewers out there tuning in. Ah, Welcome, welcome to Toyota's biggest launch of the year 2020. And we're looking forward to surprises. So stick till the end of this live session. You guys can find out, especially car enthusiasts out there. And speaking of surprises, we have our two VIPs here already waiting to unveil the two new vehicles. So with us is Mr. Akio Takeyama, who is the Deputy Chairman as well as Chief Motorsports Officer Takeyama-san. Konbanwa. And also Mr. Ravindran K, Mr. President himself, Mr. Ravi. Our ambassadors are here. What would you like to say to them? Hi, Jana and Sukri. You guys look good, man. Thank you. Well, yeah, best of the world. <laughs> and uh, Takeyama-san, it's a big night for Toyota. What would you like to see to the ambassadors? Hi guys, today I have a lot in store of us. Ooh, have a surprise. Wow. Surprise. See, even as ambassadors, you still got the surprise <laughs> face. Look at that. All right. So, gentlemen and lady, are we ready for the reveal? Yes. yes. Wow. Very good. All right. I would like to invite Encik Shukri Yahya to join Mr. Ravi. Takeyama-san, please join Jananik right here. Ladies and gentlemen, the moment you've been waiting for, we shall be unveiling our two new vehicles on the count of three, two, one. Ladies and gentlemen, we give you the all-new Toyota Vios and the all-new Toyota Yaris.
There you are, boys and girls. Not one, but two surprises. Oh my goodness, what a beautiful car, Mr. Ravi. Toyota has outdone itself. So what are your thoughts with the all-new Vios? This car looks slick more than it looks. It has Toyota safety sense, making it a very safe car to drive. So do you think it's safe to drive, Cik Shukri Ayah? Yes, I agree with Mr. Ravi. Ah. Okay, sekarang ni saya nak cerita, Abang Nas. Okay. Bila saya memandu je kereta ni, uh -huh. saya rasa lebih selamat dan selesa. Nak pula hmm. kalau memandu dengan family. Kalau saya memandu sendiri pula, ah. saya rasa lebih cool dan stylish. Alamak! <laughs> dan, oh, features paling saya suka. Yes. Abang boleh tengok dekat depan ni, dia punya grill yang baru dan dia punya head, uh, LED headlamp. Nampak lebih ini, garang, ini eh? Favorite you lah. Berapa yes. bintang? Terima kasih. Saya kasih 10 bintang. 10 bintang untuk Toyota Vios yang baru. So ladies and gentlemen, let's move on to the all new Toyota Yaris. Kepada ambassador kita, Cik Janani, macam mana perasaan anda? Hello, okay. Saya memang happy lah eh, dengan yang baru ni. Uh, nampak tak? Kalau kita tengok dia punya facelift dia, memang sangat-sangat seksi lah. Memang nampak muda. Duduk sebelah ni makin muda. Tengok Mr. Q duduk sebelah. Ha, nampak rugged. Sebab tu, kereta ni dia memang sangatlah sporty, uh, super stylish dan sesuai untuk uh, golongan yang nak nampak muda pun boleh. Ya, terima kasih. Yang, ha, yang, yang, yang nampak muda. Yang rasa and muda. Lagi satu, dia punya design hatchback ni memang sesuai untuk saya. Dan yang paling penting, dia punya safety features. Okay, safety features dia adalah dia punya uh, kereta ni sekiranya ada ris risiko pelanggaran di hadapan mm -hmm. secara automatik dia akan memperlahankan kenderaan dia. Oh. Ah, ada tak? Toyota hmm. Safety Sense. Hebat bukan? Well done, well done. Takeyama san. This yep. is a beautiful car and uh, what are your thoughts with this unveiling? Yes, the Yaris has always been about refined styling. Mm. And this is a unique appeal, the new bold design is no exception of course and the uh, Jana mentioned Yaris has also packed the features to always keep your drive safe keep your drive safe and keep you feeling young I guess maybe this is the car for you so thank you very much gentlemen and lady and there you are ladies and gentlemen the unveiling of the all new Vios and all new Yaris but that's not all for this evening stick around till the end of this show we've got another surprise to understand the credo of Toyota when we talk about GR Gazoo Racing! Hi guys, saya Nabil Ahmad dan anda bersama saya dalam segmen Gazoo Racing! Yeah! Yes, hi! Memang guys! Sebab kita nak launch Season 4 TJR Festival Vios Challenge! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, that's right, let me show you what I have for you for Season 4 Vios Challenge! Yeah! yeah! is going to amazing with all the semi-pro and professional racers. Mm. TGR Vios Challenge will be going to MCS yes. and 
es Juan K. Eh, leh, tapi leh aku tak sabar nak racing kali ni gunakan Bios yang baru sebab apa tau? Aku akan jadi champion. Wey, sabar dulu. Sebelum nak jadi champion, kita kena kenal dulu siapa dia challenger-challenger untuk Bios Challenge Promotional Class. Roll it! Okay guys, let us introduce our promotional class racer. Okay, hi guys. Sekarang ni saya rasa bersyukur sangat-sangat sebab terpilih sekali lagi untuk TGR uh, Racing uh, Challenge pada musim keempat dan uh, saya sangat-sangat happy sekarang ni sebab dapat uh, berjumpa dengan uh, semua rakan-rakan artis dekat sini. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And that's for me. Thank you so much to Toyota Gazoo Racing Malaysia. Alhamdulillah dapat bersama-sama lagi untuk season keempat dan Wani tak sabar sebenarnya nak masuk track, nak panaskan track dan nak titik orang-orang baru. Wow! Wow! <laughs> and as for me, I'm honoured and excited to be part of TGR family again for this season. So of course, I miss my friend, I miss the track, I miss the race, everything. So, macam Wani cakap tadi, kita hmm. ada orang-orang baru eh? Hmm. <laughs> Mana orang tu lah? Nak tengok lah. <laughs> nah. Okay, hi, I'm Ahirin. Uh, saya rasa sangat uh, bersyukur dan juga bangga kerana dipilih as one of the uh, racers for Toyota Gazoo Racing and Toyota Vios Challenge Season 4. Mm -hmm. So, kita orang baru habis the Toyota um, Racing School mm -hmm. and right now, kita orang dah ready untuk go on our uh, veteran class, veteran celebs dengan korang. Yeah! Um, okay, yes. I'm Talitha and I just want to say that I am really thankful to Toyota for giving me this amazing opportunity and I can't wait to prove that I can go fast. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, hi, I'm Zizan Razan. Uh, so, I'm a racer before. Uh, every time I go to the school, I race always. Oh, today. So, I masuk TGR ni semata-mata memang nak cari Nabil dan juga si Syuk ni. Mm. Dengan cerita dia orang laju betul ke? Mm. Alright. Ah, nampak dia orang goyang. Hey. Nampak dia orang goyang. Goyang. 3, 4. It's time! There you have it guys. Our promotional <laughs> class races. Mm -hmm. New season, new racer, new challenge. Ho, oh, tak sabar nak tengok apa jadi dekat season 4 ni. Dan sekarang ni jom kita nak tengok kereta-kereta untuk Vios challenge kali ini. Back to you Abang Nas. Woo! Ya, terima kasih Encik Nabil tapi wah wah Zizan yakinnya kamu baru pertama kali first season ni Nabil tolong tunjukkan ke abang Zizan kita mana tinggi langit mana rendah bumi and for all viewers out there we're still on location look at this beautiful car my goodness ah to be behind the wheel of one of these babies look at the decals and all set for the new season of Toyota Gazoo Racing so watch out for it uh, as we uh, set things up right here insyaAllah kepada semua yang sedang menonton kita ada pelbagai lagi yang kita paparkan untuk anda so, oh oh my goodness it's Alex Yu come on guys come on guys Ooh, Malaysia's first F1 driver oh my goodness oh where are you where are you oh, there you are oh man good to see you and what are you doing here well I heard there's a massive surprise coming on um, I'm here because of the Gazoo Racing Young Driver Development Program it's really cool what Toyota are doing right now they're investing in the future of Malaysian motorsports mm -hmm. and we have six young drivers drivers in the program behind you, mm -hmm. four from traditional karting mm -hmm. and two from sim racing background and, and these are the best of the best that Malaysia has right now. Yeah, I thought they were your bodyguards, man. <laughs> no, so, not quite. <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to interview this fine lad over here. What's your name and how old are you? Uh, my name is Troy Ayman and I'm 16 years old. 16 years old, uh, no license, cannot drive a car? Unfortunately not. But you can drive one of these babies around. So how's it been, transition from karting to the VR challenge? 
Oh, it's been great. You know, learning to drive a manual car is definitely my first ever experience. So mm. I've definitely enjoyed the whole process. The young people can easily, you know, just get into it. Like, oh, well done, man. Looking forward to seeing you on track. You. Let's see what this man is all about. What's your name and how old are you? My name is Juan. I'm 18 years old. Are you the eldest? Um, no, I'm the second eldest, actually. The second eldest. So how many years have you been cutting? I've been cutting since 2015, so about five years now. Five years, so yeah. more experience than anybody else here? Um, not quite, I don't think. All right, and how's the transition been from karting to the VR Challenge? Yeah, it's been quite a unique experience coming from karts to cars. Mm -hmm. There's a learning curve to be. Steep learning curve or...? Rollercoaster. Rollercoaster, all right, man. Keep on fighting, keep on yes. fighting the good fight. Ah, yang ini jambu sikit. Ni siapa nama jambu ni? How old are you as well? My name is Amir Harjafi and I'm 17 years old. 17 years old and like I've asked everybody, how long have you been cutting? Uh, set to seven, seven to eight years now. So I've accumulated around like three Asian titles. Whoa, had to slot that in, three Asian <laughs> titles. Well done, well done. But that was cutting. Now it's the big boys. Yeah. How's that been for you? So like Troy said, uh, it's just the manual gearbox we have to get used to. The driving techniques and the lines and the throttling, everything is quite similar but uh, a few things we have to adapt to. Alright, so happy adapting and looking forward to see you blazing it on the track, man. And this, you look familiar with the other guy. Are you guys brothers or something? No, uh, he's a bit better looking, so <laughs> not quite brothers. Yeah. Wow, so modest young people. So what's your name, how old are you and how long have you been uh, karting or simming? I'm actually a sim driver. My name is Mika Kimi, 17 years old. Mm -hmm. And the difference between simming and big boys, Toyota Vios Challenge. Uh, it's not actually that different. Uh, you know, a lot of people think uh, there's a huge difference, but I don't really feel that. No. no. All right. Who's the biggest name you've raced with on the sim? Uh, biggest uh, is like uh, Fernando Alonso, Max mm. Verstappen, Jensen Button. There's a lot. I've raced against a lot of high-level drivers. So. Did you win? Uh, <laughs> you can say I have. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well done. One up for Malaysia. And uh, whoa, we look, we have this professor looking person over <laughs> here. How old are you and what's your name? So my name is Naki Bazwan. I'm 20 years old, the oldest out of all. You're the oldest, all right, the one with the most experience. That's so what's, what's it like babysitting all these boys? I don't think they need babysitting. I think, you know, we can all learn from each other, so not much. Wonderful. So you're a simmer as well. And how long, have, how many hours have you logged in? Four, I think us sim races, we can log in a lot of hours. Personally, I think I've done 40 hours a week. 40 hours, it's like playing a video game, right? Yep. I mean, not really, actually. <laughs> a bit different, but more serious. Yes, that's why I tried to convince my mom. She never believed me, so <laughs> I never had a go. But all the best as well. Thank you. Very cool. And you look like the youngest of all. How old are you? Yes, indeed, I'm the youngest. I'm 14 years of age. 14 years? What's your name? My name is Putra Adam. Putra Adam, 14 years old, no license. Probably no license to see girlfriend or so. Got girlfriend? Huh? No, 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 mommy get angry. Uh. But what's it like for you? Are you a cutter or Sema? I am a cutter, yeah. How long have you been cutting? I've been cutting for approximately seven years. Yeah. Seven years? So you started when you were seven years old? Yep, yeah. Can you even reach the pedals? I could, but I could barely <laughs> see the road. Still work. <laughs> could barely see the road and now look at you blazing a trail with the Dios challenge. So what's the biggest fear that you have? The biggest fear I have is not being able to keep up with the big boys, but I think I'll handle that quite well. I think you'll handle it quite well as well. All the best to you in the race. All right, and there you are. Ladies and gentlemen, we spoke to some of the young rookies in the Toyota Gazoo Racing, uh, the rookie program. So if you guys want to find out more about it, hey, take a look at this. First, I'd like to congratulate you for being selected. It's very hard for drivers to get the necessary experience to become professional racers. And we've got a lot of talent in Malaysia. Maybe even world level. It's been my dream to drive a circuit like this. You're racing not for yourself, but as a team, there's always something to learn and it's not wrong to ask for help. If I'm not on their level, I work hard to be on their level. I always wanted to go forward and always wanted to win. Just gonna prove to them that even though we are young, we're still talented.
allow me to officially welcome you to the Gazoo Racing family. They are the hope of the future, the diamonds in the rough, so we polish them to shine brightly like the stars in the sky for Malaysian motorsports. And talking about top drivers, we are going to be speaking to a legend of Malaysian motorsports. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the Prince of Drift, Tengku Jan Le is here with me. Hello. I'm honored to be in your presence. Thank you, thank you for having me. And so, um, how long have you been involved with TGR? Yeah, so I've been involved in the Toyota Gazoo Racing Vios Challenge for a good three years now. Mm -hmm. And recently, um, part of the Gazoo Racing Talent Program as a racing coach. So, um, yeah, you know, I'm here and uh, officially Gazoo Racing mm -hmm. has seen me fit as mm -hmm. the ambassador. So I have to thank both uh, Takayama-san and Mr. Ravi. Oh, revelation after revelation. And we have Takayama-san and Mr. Ravi over here. Come, let's join him. You can... Uh, well, say thank you personally, of course. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. And now, we want to ask Tengku Jan, um, what's the experience like uh, riding this next revelation that we could be revealing to you? Well, okay. Um, a car is more than just a vehicle. Mm -hmm. And to invoke that emotion is very important to get the driver involved excited, in driving. Yeah? And excited in driving. And Toyota Gazoo Racing is really doing this with their new product mm. and they're injecting that joy in driving. Ah, right? the credo of Toyota yes. Gazoo Racing. It really puts a smile to your face. Rewarding experience, fun to drive, awesome, awesome. Looking forward to this next big reveal. So, what Gentlemen, do you think? are we ready? Yeah, Ravi, is it time? Let's show them. You said it, sir. Come, let's take our positions. Let's go. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, our final surprise of the night, the new Toyota Vios GRS and the new GR Yaris. And first, let's concentrate on the Vios GRS. Mr. Ravi, I understand it's a first for Malaysia, yes? We are very proud to be first in the region to show this model. You saw that Chuba, kan? Yeah, Mr. Ravi, saya dah cuba memandu kereta ni dekat Lita itu. Best gila, nak pula masa handling time corner. Yes. <laughs> oh, handling time corner. Untungnya jadi ambassador. <laughs> Untung sungguh. Ladies and gentlemen, we give you the all new Toyota Vios GRS. It starts with a belief. A mission. A desire to rise through every challenge with our sight aimed at the sky. We're pushing the limits in the never-ending race towards ever better. Every lap is a discovery of what it takes to accelerate our capabilities. And we're not slowing down. We evolved to satisfy that calling from within. To get the adrenaline racing. To bring extraordinary to the everyday. Take on the exhilaration. New Vios 
GR Sport, built to thrill. Wow. Hey Shukri, how was the ride? Best! Handling the best! Dah rasa macam dalam kereta lumba! Oh, awesome! <laughs> Let's take the opportunity to introduce this car to our viewers. <laughs> kereta ni nampak lebih sporty kan? Cuba tengok. Tapi sebenarnya, dia telah disuntik dengan DNA Toyota Gazoo Racing di dalam. Desain GR Sport pada bahagian bumper depan, grill dan aero kit membuatkan kereta ni nampak lebih agresif. Penggunaan lampu LED depan membuatkan dia kelihatan lebih slick dan ditambah pula dengan daytime running light membuatkan kereta ni nampak lebih garang. Ia juga didatangkan dengan wing mirror dan door handle berwarna hitam bagi menyerlahkan lagi image sporty pada kereta ini. Di bahagian belakangnya pula, kombinasi lampu LED yang kelihatan lebih slick dan didatangkan pula dengan spoiler dan aero kit berwarna hitam dan untuk menjadikan satu kereta sport yang lengkap, yang ini mahal. Emblem GR Sport diletakkan pada kereta ini untuk menyerlahkan lagi identiti kereta ini. Jadi, kini anda memiliki peluang untuk memiliki model kereta Toyota Gazoo Racing milik anda sendiri. Secara keseluruhan, untuk design language model Vios GR Sport ini lebih stylish dan lebih sporty. Malah saya berani kata, design model ini mirip dengan GR Yaris yang juga dibawa masuk oleh UMW Toyota. The Vios GRS was envisioned to give you a fun to drive driving experience. To me personally, the car actually has dual personality. So on your regular daily drive, you can enjoy a comfortable ride with upgraded safety features courtesy of Toyota Safety Sense. And if you decide to take it up a notch, it actually transforms itself into a refined version of the race car. Where the Vios GRS really shines is in its ride and handling. Wheels, tires, springs and dampers are all working as one finely developed to provide you a sporty driving experience. I believe the Toyota engineers have went through great lengths to accomplish this. The Vios GRS comes equipped with beautifully designed in black accent 17-inch wheels and it is actually wrapped with Toyota's Proxus TR1 which is equipped in all the TGR Vios Challenge cars. The responsive 10-speed CVT transmission now available in the new Vios GRS provides you that fun factor while maximizing the potential of the engine. Another nice touch with the GRS is the pedal shifters which replicate a gear shift and allows you to have manual control while firmly keeping your hands on the steering wheel. Even though the Vios GRS gives you that experience of sporty driving, it does not compromise on comfort and safety. Toyota Gazoo Racing has come a long way since 2007, building a strong brand presence within the motorsports community. The iconic GR logo is positioned in many prominent places in the car. You have the seats, push start button, and the MID, which greets you every time you start the car. I also like how the speedometer is decked out in red with red illumination. For me, the highlight of the GRS interior is the semi-bucket sport seats. They have great hip support to keep me in place when I'm maneuvering around the corners, but at the same time comfortable enough for long distance driving. You can now experience the new Vios GR Sport at selected Toyota showrooms. So book a test drive and experience it for yourself now. Check out for more details at the Toyota website. It's all about the drive. So we're scared to Last. Oh, beautiful, magnifique Subarashin, eh? <laughs> ah, the all new Toyota Vios GRS. And for those of you car enthusiasts who are speculating, is the GR Yaris coming? Is it coming to Malaysia? Yes, it is. Takayama san, can you please give us some comments? Yes, it's here. The wait is over. The car is remarkable engineering feat. I want to also point out the heritage this car, the born from rally dominance. The car is a unique personality, confident with a strong attitude and character. Its performance and perfection in one total package. Insight from you, Jan? Well, it is a homologation special for the road. 
So what you're seeing here is the real deal and we had a drive in it and honestly it lives up to the hype. Oh goodness gracious me, we talk about mm. three cylinder turbocharged oh engine. So it's fun car to drive on it the road. It's really fun. So I mean it's connected <gasps> and it puts a smile on your face. Oh my goodness. Oh it's already putting a smile on my face. Can you say this is going to be a cult classic for Malaysians? Most definitely. Yes, yes! Looking at the lines already, my goodness. Who Ailio Malele? Don't don't believe me? Don't believe me? Ladies and gentlemen, the all-new GR Yaris. This one's for the passionate who won't play it safe and take corners without brakes. This one's for the racers, the mechanics, navigators, the drifters. All in one, no fuss, road racer. To the ones who love it dirty, who embrace the unknown, who speak in codes. Uncaged, unstoppable, this is an untamed spirit. Born from WRC Toyota GR Yaris, now in Malaysia. GR Yaris is born from WRC, a rally car for the world. For us, it's important because rally is the best place to develop a performance car. This is where control, handling, durability, adaptability, and versatility of the car is proven. To be honest, this is a car I've been waiting for, and it sure lives up to the hype. It has been more than 20 years, and such cars are truly rare these days. Bear in mind, Toyota is building only 25,000 units of the GR Yaris worldwide. The GR Yaris is built on a bespoke platform. Everything about this car is engineered for driving performance and perfection. It's lighter, more rigid and stiff. Also, it has more aerodynamic design. The car is built on the same line as the legendary LFA at Motomach plant, or what we fondly call the GL plant. I noticed that lightweight materials are used throughout the car. The use of carbon fiber roof, which reduces the center of gravity, the aluminum panels such as the door panels, bonnet and boot, this gives the car an overall lighter weight to optimize the performance delivery. The car also has additional well points and adhesives for improved torsional and bending stiffness, which is a critical trait for a sports tuned car. This allows the GI Yaris to come with rimless windows. The three-door body style aids aerodynamics. The lower roof line of 95mm achieves better wind flow, allowing better downforce. The one-of-a-kind and sophisticated suspension system, which is an independent double wishbone rear setup, provides for better control and even more room for tuning for car enthusiasts. The 1.6-litre three-cylinder engine is currently the lightest, smallest, most powerful three-cylinder engine in the world. It's good for daily driving, but also maximum potential on normal road. The GI Yaris red lines at 7,000 RPM, achieving 0 to 100 in 5.5 seconds. The three cylinders contribute to weight reduction without compromising on performance. This is pure exhilaration. It's refreshing to have a six-speed manual transmission in a car for that ultimate human-machine connection. Also, a small turbocharged manual transmission with a four-wheel drive is something you cannot get these days. The intelligent manual transmission and auto blip system that rev matches automatically on downshifts. This helps for a smoother downshift and the heartbreaking keeping the car stable at all times. I also appreciate the shorter gear ratio and the gear lever position which is closer to the steering wheel. The car feels extremely punchy and it's fun to shift gears. The GR Yaris is a full-time four-wheel drive vehicle that has variable front to rear torque distribution in several drive modes. It also has a mechanical handbrake. We want you to do handbrake turns. In normal mode, the distribution is 60% front and 40% rear for perfect daily driving conditions. And this is where the fun begins. So in sports mode, the distribution changes 30 front, 70 rear. I could actually feel the difference where the car felt very neutral, allowing me to drive it sideways if I wanted to. In track mode, for weekend drives on the track, the distribution is 50-50 providing for ultimate grip. The GI Yaris now comes with 4 port calipers, 356mm brake discs with slotted rotors as standard. 
The brake ducts are purposefully positioned at the front bumper to provide optimal cooling for the brakes. The mechanical handbrake is impressive. It allowed the rear axle to decouple when the handbrake is operated and I had a feel of time on track until I ran out of tyres. What's more, the performance pack comes standard with GRERs. The car also comes with forged 18-inch BBS rims with Michelin PS4 tyres. I'm excited about the performance pack with front and rear torsion limited slip differentials with stiffer springs and dampers. This provides even better response during braking, cornering and better grip overall. This set of forged wheels are lighter and stronger, improving unsprung mass. These are actually one of the best road tyres you can buy. Thanks to Toyota Gazoo Racing, we get to enjoy this wonderful engineering feat which is the GI Yaris. This is really being part of the motorsports heritage and I'm truly excited about this. Race cars that drive well can only become powerful when pushed to the limits. The same rule will apply for the cars we deliver to our customers. The GR Yaris is a testimony to our commitment to build ever better cars for you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, all good things must come to an end. There you have it, the revelation. Reveal to all of you the brand new Toyota Vios GRS and the GR Yaris that makes its way to Malaysia kepada dua ambassador kita, Ambassador Yaris Jana Nick dan juga Ambassador Vios Shukri Hayat. Terima kasih banyak-banyak. Jana, teruja tak dengan uh, GR Yaris yang baru ni? Bukan teruja je. Ya huh? Allah, suka nak bawa balik. <laughs> eh, sampai okay. Ajilah. Oh, ha. Tiba-tiba dah. Tiba-tiba dah. Tapi yang paling penting is uh, moment kita bersama dengan juga uh, racer-racer yang lain hmm, bersama dengan Abang Nas juga thank you oh, Abang Nas terima kasih banyak-banyak saya yang teruja bersama dengan anda semua uh, Syukri Yaya pula sebagai Ambassador Vios pandangan anda tentang GRS ini GRS ni memang lain lah bang lain lah sebab mula-mula saya ingat kejutan malam ni adalah kejutan biasa, biasa je rupanya hmm. dia orang nak buat kejutan dan utama dia adalah GR Yaris dengan Vios GRS ni. Yeah. Alah tu mesti saya tak boleh nak get over lah bang. Tak boleh get over. Tak tak lah. Sabar lah. jelah get over. Eh, ha. Tapi bang bakat-bakat muda yang baru sekarang ni ha, yang rookie tu sama je rookie bang tapi saya tengok macam tahan tau. Oh. Jadi jana Hmm. Podium tak ada yang tahu awak kali ini Eh, hey, kan? mana tahu ayam-ayam masih boleh berulang yeah. ya. Biar putih tulang, jangan putih mata Terima kasih, Jana Nick Terima kasih, Syukri Yahya, Ambassador, Ambassador And thank you to you guys, car enthusiasts out there Who have patiently been with us all the way till the end of the show Remember, look out for the Vios GRS If you see it on the road, looking beautiful Snap a picture, Mwah, magnifique And also, for those of you expecting the GR Yaris Yes, it's here in Malaysia and you can view it at the GR Garage or Gazoo Racing Garage. It's not at any uh, run-of-the-mill uh, uh, showroom. It's at the GR Garage. What's that all about? Watch this video. Meanwhile, dengan Jana Nik dan juga Syukri Yaya, kita nak ucapkan Assalamualaikum. Selamat malam semua. Thank you for watching. Bye. Di depan, saya nampak de uh, di depan dia tu, di bumper depan, lain. Dia nampak, nampak lagi, lagi, lagi cuci, lagi agresif, lagi garang lah. Sesuai dengan saya kan. <laughs> Dan, um, saya ada nampak yang dia GR Sport ni, dia macam ada suntikan DNA Toyota Gazoo Racing dalam kereta. Well, first of all, uh, you can see that design cue between all the GR models, um, especially from the uh, GR Yaris. You can see that flow through now to the Vios, GRS and all that. So, I like it. It's, it's actually very macho uh, and very peaceful at the same time. First time, don't say more laju kereta Vios uh, GR Sport. 
Dia cakap, oh boy, ke aku nak bawa ni? Aku takut mistake ke apa kan? <laughs> Pasal dia orang, okay, so bawa je lagi, so kita nak rakam. Saya cakap, boleh ke ni kan? So, nervous tu ada tau. Jadi saya bawa tu, saya terkejut. Dia punya handling sangat responsif dan dia bagi saya feedback yang cukup baik. <laughs> dia bagi saya feedback yang cukup baik dan saya rasa yakin saya selamat bila bawa kereta laju dalam track ni. Um, so a lot of it comes down to the actual feeling while driving and uh, trying to put that in words is not so easy you know um, to make you experience it in words so I think that was the biggest challenge for me but I hope you did a good job and <laughs> saya ni satu saya tengok Uh, drone tu dekat bawah Dia tu dekat floor Saya ingat bila saya datang Dia akan naik Dia boleh masuk bawah kereta Kak <laughs> Saya ingat seorang dia ada Dia punya shot dia masuk bawah kereta Okay, TGR prides itself In pushing the limits To develop ever better cars Through motorsports And that is now translated by the Vios GRS which we see today, not just in Malaysia but regionally. To see it grow in Malaysia and worldwide actually is uh, very heartwarming uh, being a motorsports fan. So again, I am super honoured to be part of this journey. Bang, saya nak cakap lah. Saya rasa kan, kereta GR Sport ni, bila saya bawa dia, kalau saya bawa di atas jalan raya, saya rasa macam saya bawa kereta GR Challenge dekat dalam track. Memang betul. Yeah. Uh, I find, like I said, that integration kan, hmm. uh, antara comfort dengan handling tu memang bagus. So, you drive slow, you get that, you you get that Vios feeling. <laughs> But when you go faster, it actually transforms and it becomes very similar to the actual race car. Jom, nak tahu apa yang saya suka dekat kereta bias baru ni? No. Saya suka depan dia. Pace dia depan. Nampak lebih garam kan? Jom, ada lagi. Sure. Sebab dia nak dapat ni. Emblem GR Sport dan saya suka dekat bahagian sini Sporty gila What I like about the Vios GRS is definitely the front end So it's sleek um, very sporty and it flows through uh, basically all the new GR designs so that's what I like about it and the next feature would definitely be the 17 inch wheels so I think it looks great on the car uh, it has presence and of course it's equipped with high performance Toyo tyres Senang Style Design yang mantap Handling yang sedap Kalau kau nak tahu sendiri Kau nak try You've got to experience it for yourself to understand what the GR Vios uh, GRS is all about and um, I think you will definitely enjoy it. Kali ini berbeza sebab dia bertemakan futuristic. Futuristic tau. <laughs> konsep penggambaran hari ini sangat-sangatlah menarik. Ha, sebab dia menggunakan konsep virtual reality dan juga futuristic. Ha, tu ada pakai futuristic class lah. Ha, and sangat-sangat uh, challenging juga pasal uh, you have to imagine benda yang tak ada kat situ. Ha, and then later on baru dia orang akan uh, masukkan CGI, the process. Kau tu kan? Menarik kan? Bila apa, uh, jump tu, this just pop out, keluar benda macam ni dan kita slide Kita macam, oh saya rasa macam time tu saya Tony Stark lah <laughs> So itu adalah perbezaan dia yang maknanya Saya kena buat benda hanya menggunakan imajinasi saya sendiri Experience shooting kali ni, uh, the whole time 
I was like um, I was curious lah tahu apa dia Apa dia kan Apa dia director Minta ni Because uh, We don't see Apa yang dia nak Kita tak tahu kan Dia nak buat macam mana uh, And at the same time uh, I, I'm excited to see How they will look like Okay, ladies first. <laughs> okay, our uh, first impression kita dengan New Yaris ni memanglah sangat-sangat macam hu, sportinya. Mm. Ha. So dia punya dep- yang paling obvious sekali dia punya uh, facelift depan dia tu lah. Kan, dengan lampu dia, LED headlamp dia tu memang nampak sangat-sangat modern, cantik. Sama 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 sama. Macam saya pula, saya suka Bios baru ni dia berbeza dengan model yang lama tau Yang baru ni nampak lebih moden Dan lebih style Saya paling suka sekali lampu depan dia Dia menggunakan LED dan Bumper depan dia Lain Dia buatkan uh, kereta Vios yang baru ni Lebih berkarakter So when I got a text message I kena imagine ada text message So I dah imagine macam Oh text message tu macam one paragraph So I baca lah macam Last kali sebenarnya Tak sebenarnya tu tiga perkataan je Benda tu Fun saya buat Challenging Ah, Tapi bila fikirkan balik Eh kelakar juga ha. lah Lah lepas tu kita pakai Cermin mata besar tu Saya Kalau syukri memang takkan pakai lah cermin mata besar ni <laughs> <laughs> Tapi jana mungkin <laughs> Saya suka tengok Vios yang baru ni Pasal dia ada penambahbaikan dalam Kereta Vios tu sendiri Jadi bila saya memang dulu saya rasa Saya rasa Lebih tenang dan lebih selamat hmm. yeah. Penambahan Penambahbaikan dari segi keselamatan Safety Betul. kereta tu Macam Yaris yang baru ni Dia ada uh, lane departure alert Dan juga ada pre-collision system so, Kau tahu tak? Bila kereta hmm. depan break Dia akan automatically memperlahankan kereta kita Oh ah. ok jadi Pesan untuk kita berlanggan dengan kereta depan tu Berkurangan, maksudnya Memang uh, takkan lah Adalah emergency brake Adalah macam kita akan Faham, 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 faham. faham. Ha, Eh, bagus yang, je ha, Bagus, memang bagus gila yang ni So, tak suka gila Dan yang kedua uh, Dia punya uh, lane departure alert Ha, yang ni So, dia ada uh, alert tu Dia akan bagi tahu kau uh, Ya, awak sekarang ni dah keluar daripada lane awak Oh, ha, okay So, safety kali ni memanglah kau-kau So, sangatlah orang kata bagus Benda yang kita perlu ambil berat dalam uh, kenderaan kita ha. Betul Yaris is the real thing and this is the best choice for your active lifestyle. Drive it and live your life. Oh wow. The new Vios is built to exceed. Jadi korang kena rasai pengalaman pemanduan tu sendiri dengan Vios yang baru.